Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Amanda if you are new here. If you're not new, welcome back. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. This is going to be a really quick grocery haul for WW for the week. I didn't get too much food, but I did stock up on a few good items. Um, it was a very limited choice at the grocery store at Walmart, if you guys know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Most of you probably do. Um, very limited items, but I still feel like I did pretty good and I'm going to be able to stay on track. I got a lot of things that I am going to be using for recipes that I'm going to be making for my meal prep for the week. So make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss out and give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. That helps my channel out so much. So smash that like button and let's just jump right into the grocery haul I'm just gonna do a point in view since it is such a small haul I'm gonna just point in view and show you guys what I got from Walmart so I got some Banza spaghetti pasta this is made from chickpeas I also have like the elbow one I believe um and I am gonna make some spaghetti with some sun-dried tomato meatballs for the week for meal prep that's gonna be something we can you know have in bulk I got some celery for a soup I'm going to be making, some bananas, one white onion, and some carrots, two things of lettuce because we are going to be having lots of salads, and then I got some Parmesan cheese. I like to just put this on eggs. Um, it's really good with eggs and also salads. We got some coffee. This is our French vanilla coffee we like to get. It's really good, flavored, really yummy. I got some Sam's Choice Smoked Chicken Apple Sausages. These are really good. I've had them before and I really liked them. Also got some air fried Tyson chicken. These are chicken breast strips and I'm going to pop them in the air fryer for like that moment where you want fried chicken tenders. <laughs> you can, this is a good option for that. We got some honey roasted blue almonds. These are really good for snacks. We're going to have some sandwiches, easy lunches this week for sure. Hot jalapeno and habanero jack cheese. This sounds so good. And then we got some oven roasted chicken breast. And then for those chicken tenders that I got, I like to dip them in Bolt House Classic Ranch. This is made of yogurt and it's just so good and I highly recommend. This is new. I've never tried this, but we love the pretzel crisp, and we've almost tried every flavor, I feel like. Um, but this one is a sweet one. This one is cinnamon sugar, which I've never seen before, and it looks so good, you guys. This is the nutritional facts on it. So 10 crackers, 28 grams for 100 calories, but I think for like a little dessert, that would be really nice. I got some creamer. If you are new to my channel, I do the real thing. <laughs> usually I do two tablespoons and usually this kind of creamer is around three smart points. Um, this is the Oreo one, which actually I've never had before. One tablespoon is 35 calories. And like I said, usually two tablespoons is three smart points, but I will leave it on the screen if that's incorrect. And then I just add one fourth cup unsweetened oat milk for one smart point and that's my coffee combo because I can just not do sugar-free creamer that's like the one thing that's sugar-free that I cannot do <laughs> um you just have to kind of make it work with what you like you know right, I got some more whips these are my favorite yogurt ever and they're like dessert for me I got the strawberry cheesecake and these are four smart points for one we got the vanilla cupcake and this one's so good the lemon this one, the lemon meringue, so good. We got some french fries. I have been in the mood for french fries. So instead of going out and getting them, I'm gonna just make them at home, weigh them out, and have me a nice little portion of some french fries. These are the best. Nathan's Jumbo Crinkle Cut French Fries. These are so good. I actually used to work at a bar, um, and they sold these and like for people to eat, like bar food, um, and they were, the best fries. I can never not have those. So those are my favorites. We got some toasted chips to go with some hummus. Also, we got some carrots that could go with this. This is roasted red pepper hummus. It's very good. And sour and um, onion cream Ritz toasted chips. Eggs, of course. Real bacon pieces for our salads. This is like a must for us. You guys have probably know that by now. The best thing. For a salad it's so good chicken broth for a soup i'm going to be preparing and then we got tons of croutons we got three bags of croutons my husband and i both love croutons you guys and the key to croutons is to weigh them out in grams you get way more if you weigh them out in grams so i highly recommend doing that so we got three bags of croutons 
and then crispy red peppers i've never had these i've had the onions and the jalapenos but never peppers and i do like peppers so i figured this would be really good and i wanted to try it out for you guys let you guys know if i like it so i'm super excited to add that to a salad and then over here we just have some chicken and then i also got some beef which is in the freezer so just some chicken breast from walmart you know and that is the overview of the grocery haul so that is it for the grocery haul for the week like I said, it's a pretty small grocery haul, but we were pretty limited to our options. Um, and we need to just eat what we have. We have a very small space. You guys know we live in an RV. I did a very big grocery haul. I think the Trader Joe's and I did, did a Walmart grocery haul. I'll leave that linked here if you want to see it. We still have so much food left from that. So we are pretty stocked up on food. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video, which should be my meal prep. So I hope you guys are all doing well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.